One, good. Two, strong. Three, good. Four, five. You got seven. Six, seven, one more. Eight, wow. Come on. Nine, wow. And ten. Holy moly. Ten reps, right? Yes. Wow. Let me double check my weight. Was that 45, 35? That's 205. Plus a five. And a two and a half. That's 220. That's almost 225. The, the 225 pound NFL combine test, 10 reps would be pretty good, you know? I mean, it wouldn't break any records, but, and, and you were doing this very strict. Have you seen the way they bounce, you know, on the NFL combine for the bench press? I'm a little nervous. I'm not even sure if I can do that. Good job. All right, is that surprising to you? No. So you do this at school regularly? Yes. With what weight? Um, I did 225 for like six or something. But have you, have you done 220 for 10 at school? No. Wow. Ah. I'm starting to think I'm pretty good at this coaching stuff. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, maybe it's this bench too. It's very comfortable. <laughs> So you just did very well here. Um, what do you want to try? Let's go for a one rep max. You want to just kind of bump it up slowly? Uh, we need to put like 250 on it. Okay, so this is 220. All right, yeah, let's go with the 245s. <laughs> on the days where you're doing, you know, you're, you're strong, you definitely want to take advantage of that and break some records. That is 250. It's only 15 pounds heavier on each side in which you just did 10 reps. Five pounds more on each side. 
very impressive. Um, a lot of these guys are using elbow wraps and wrist straps and all that crap. Okay, so this is officially 285. I got a 245, 25, and a 5. Okay. Alright, here we go. On three. One, two, three. Come on. Light, light, light. Let's go. Push! I'm just going to add two and a half. <laughs> so that was 285. Yes. Okay. 290. Alright, let me see if I can do this now. I don't know. I I'm not quite ready to get to the point where you're stronger than me. <laughs> I was hoping for a little more time. <laughs> But I get a shot, because that's how we roll. I had a cheat night last night, tanked up on calories and sugar. It ain't gonna be no problem! Ha! I might get two! I'm gonna lift up. Alright, three, two, one. sessions man. Alright, same thing. Let me know when you're ready, I'll step up. Alright. On three. One, two, three. Come on man. Up. Oh, oh, just... yeah. up, 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 up. It's okay. Still new territory. Alright. So 285. Yeah. All right, 285 is the new PR. Good job. All right, so 60. You did 45 seconds last time. Have a 10-second countdown. <sighs> I think you're okay. I'll move this bar once you're okay. Are you good? Two, one. The key here is they're not touching. You're keeping them parallel. So that means you bring that one like that, and that one over there on the same side, same way. You don't even need me over there for a while, so I'm gonna put on some more music over here. There's your song, I want it all. Coming up on 25 seconds. When the time comes, I'm gonna take your left side. Talk to me though, let me know. Leadership skills, man. Be loud and proud. 40 seconds. Coming up on 45, 46. All right. Good job. Try to keep on turn. 52. Got it. Oh. Call it 53. Good job. Bar dips with a 10-pound uh, plate. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. Okay, for the third set, we'll do the same thing. Okay. It's going to be extra challenging, I can tell. One of the other ways you do it is like this, where you let it rest. Yeah. 
can see the advantage of that. Yes. Is that easier or harder? Very hard. Yes. <laughs> Two. Three. Four. Five. Seven, eight. Okay. We just lay it around the bench. <laughs> nice. Yep. Yeah. Don't give me none of that cross stick crap. That last one didn't count. How many was <laughs> that minus that last one? Uh, thirteen. Okay, thirteen. Good. All right. So now the second part of the drill is thirteen kettlebell uppers. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, two more, twelve, good, thirteen. You already did your last one by one rep. Rest as knee and then pull ups. Last time you got seven, no, last time you got eight. I don't know if we're going to be able to show the whole thing, but uh, what, what we're doing here is 50 total reps, 50 pull-ups, and 50 kettlebell upright rows with a 70-pound kettlebell. The goal is to do as many pull-ups with strict good form, and then match that same rep count with the kettlebell upright row. All right, it's very much conditioning. He's off camera, but he's over here breathing hard and heavy and spitting up and throwing up and hands on hips. And that's only the first set. All right, so that was 13. Whenever you're ready. Good form is the name of the game here. One, two, three, four. Last time you had eight. Five, six, seven, all the way down. Eight. Good job. Don't worry about the camera. Go whenever you're ready. As long as it's right now. So very little rest. Just walking over and immediately going into that next exercise. Getting the same number of reps as the pull-ups. Good. Set also. Man, you must have been in really good shape. <laughs> uh, if I wasn't getting over an illness, I'd be doing this with you. <laughs> this is my kind of stuff right here. Come on. One, two, there you go. Pretty good. Four. And four. Okay, well, I can double. Kettlebell real quick, give me four. It's gonna be 37 at the gun. One, two, bring those elbows up. Three, stay tight. Four, good. Alright, that's 37. Are you getting some conditioning? Yes. <laughs> Three hang power cleans, six box jumps, two, three, four, five, six, and one burpee. Good. That's four. So every minute on the minute, man, that was faster than before. Every minute on the minute, it's three hang power cleans with 155, six box jumps on a 24 inch box, and one burpee.